Okay, hi there, this is Jenny, and I'm here with Hannah, and we are going to be practicing some anti-counter-surfing countermeasures. Um, we are in our little kitchen suite here at Teamworks, so there's a lot of stuff going on. I've got a little mat set up for, um, for Hannah. We've been working on some mat work, and um, this type of situation can be a really uh, nice way to use mat work with some impulse control. <laughs> ah, thank you. Okay, good job, and uh, it gives and a little bit of an alternate behavior um, instead of checking out the counters. Um, and so we're on leash, one because we're in our lobby area, so we have doorways and people that are going to be uh, walking uh, past us. Um, so we're going to have a little bit of distraction work as well. Um, but having him on leash also gives me a little bit of control um, for keeping her from self-rewarding. So right now she's doing some nice sits on her mat, looking very good. Um, on the counter um, right above her, I've got an open jar of peanut butter and a pizza box with a pizza piece of pepperoni pizza inside, so a little food enticement. And then over by our uh, dish station, which is off camera, we've got um, some Kongs and some puzzle toys that were just washed and are hanging out in the drying rack. So that's also pretty enticing because she's a she's a good choice seeing some of those as well. Um, so it's kind of a, a little odd working on counter surfing. Um, because a lot of it is really going to be management. So in uh, Hannah's session earlier today where we worked on uh, mat work, I blocked off a lot of the areas that I felt um, Hannah would be more, most likely uh, to counter surf. So the toy shelf where we keep all of our toys, as well as um, <clears throat> some counter space where we keep some treats. So those are pretty um, high uh, probability for uh, counter surfing there. Um, so at home that would be things like kitchen counters or dining room table. Um, or if you keep her, uh, yo, you wait, what were you going to do? <laughs> you almost did it down and I gave you a treat too soon. Um, or if you have a place where you, yes, where you keep her toys, um, that's going to get to be a pretty valuable um, spot as well. So you might see her jumping up a bit more. Um, so management is going to be your first step. Um, beyond management, I'm also trying to be very aware of where any food or treats or rewards are coming from that I give to Hannah. So I don't want to be giving her anything directly from the counter. Even if it's her bag of treats that's sitting on the counter and then I'm giving her a treat, I don't want to do that because what that does is creates the association that things on the counter could potentially be mine. Um, and even if she's doing a good job, thank you. Even if she's doing a, Hannah, yes, good girl. Even if she's doing a good job, um, with uh, the task that you're asking her to do that she's earning for the treats, it still opens the counter up to um, potential exploration in the future because she has gotten something from it before. So I'm trying to be very aware of only giving treats to Hannah from my person, so either from my training belt, from a pocket, from my hand. <coughs> Thank you. Hannah. Yes, good girl. Good girl. Hannah. Can you go down? That's not a down. Try it. There it is. Good girl. Good girl. Very good. Very good. Touch. Yes. Good job. So good. Yeah. Good choice. Good job, Hannah. Very nice. Very nice. Yes, good girl. It's so good. Right here. Good job, Hannah. Good job. Yeah, let's go. Let's go this way. Yeah. Over here. Have a good girl. Yes, good job. I know you hear some noises, huh? Yes, good girl. Very good choice. Yes. <laughs> That's awesome. Very nice. We'll go by the sink. Walk over here. Yes, good choice. Good choice, hon. Is it? Yes, good girl. Very good. Who's there? Oh, good down. Very nice down. Yes, good girl. Very good, very good. Good job. Can you look? Yes. Good job. Good job, yes, good job. Down. So we have some people coming in for classes too. We got puppy class that's starting um, in the suite way on the opposite side. Um, so she's doing a good job with some distractions that, we're, that are off camera, but, but oh, oh, wait. You're so close. Keep those elbows down. 
some pups coming in for classes, um, people coming back and forth um, that she's not really seen before. So we saw her bark a little bit. I think she gets pretty excited because she's a pretty friendly girl. So she wants to, ow, oh, there we go. <clears throat> Try again. Girl. Overall, pretty good with the counter surfing. She just uh, kind of took advantage of me not watching her um, for a second there to kind of check things out. So again, using that leash um, to keep her from getting anything that's on that counter space um, can be helpful. Oh, <laughs> yeah, there you go. Yes, good girl. <laughs> awesome. So we'll stop there and we'll be back with more next time. All right, let's go.